Having my chicken marinade reviewed by a friend and taste testing wings infused with single herb varieties fresh from the garden. Stick around to get a whiff of what's cooking on the grill right now on the Cleansy Garden. Rolling? Yeah. Okay. Okay. So we've got our first two pieces on here. Hey folks, welcome back. So today, special episode, we have a friend over at Taste Buds, uh, Joyce. Oh We're gonna God, use a barbecue yes. together. She's marinating some lamb. I'm really curious to, to try it. Joyce's show, Taste Buds, is all about food exploration all over Asia. Today, she wants to learn some of the basics of working a barbecue, as well as try her hand grilling Yang Rou Tuan, Chinese lamb skewers, which she's marinated herself and bringing to the party. To see how that goes, do check out her episode. I'll yeah. leave a link below. So what I've also done is prepared three different wings and each one I've stuffed with a different herb and just that herb. No seasoning, no nothing, it's just that herb. Kept in the fridge overnight, the goal is to see how each herb impacts the flavor and fragrance of the meat and see how we like it. I'm also trying to refine my own chicken marinade, which will char grill. This will give me a chance to pick the brains of an experienced foodie. So there's lemongrass, there's curry leaves, and there's also some Asian dill, also called wormwood. Anyway, I better go get ready. She could be here any time, so... Uh... Hello, it's Joyce from Taste Buds, um, and I am very excited. Thank you for having me. <laughs> it's my pleasure. I can do this now. I think the lemongrass smell in yours is so good. We'll just have to see. Yeah. This is part of the joy of having a barbecue. People over is just to experiment and. You know, why have a garden with different things growing if you're not going to yeah. try different combinations? And, uh... So here's a quick breakdown of the three herbs. One, lemongrass. Popular in Southeast Asian cuisine and is the more conventional of the three today. Two, red stem wormwood, sometimes casually referred to as Asian dill. Used in some Asian pastries or sometimes as a garnish as it's often mistaken as dill, which has similar aromatics. And three, curry leaves. Native to the Indian subcontinent, these leaves add a complex, smoky flavor, especially when cooked in oil. Just remember though, it's not a substitute for curry powder. But first, my chicken drumsticks. I've marinated them with lemongrass, cumin, turmeric, garlic, lychee honey, soy, dark soy, and something I don't normally put in with these rings, curry leaves. Ooh, the fire. Shall we? You pick the first one. Ooh. The colors on these are amazing. There's a lot going on in here. But it's also quite mild in flavor once you get further in. Yeah. Uh, what's your opinion of the wing? I think the seasoning is very good. I just think I want it, I want more salt. I do have a tendency to undersalt. Maybe next time I'll try brining as well. Now for the single variety urban infused wings. The most interesting thing to me is the Chinese yes. dill, and uh, I'm really interested in trying that. Mm. But I'm sure the lemongrass is going to be great. I uh, actually don't know what to expect from the curry leaves either. That's pretty much exactly how I feel about okay. this. Okay, which one's lemongrass? This one's lemongrass. Okay. So let's go for it. Nice. You're, you're not going to dip it in salt? I will, I just want to, I tend to like to taste it oh, on its own first. It's all edible inside, yes. Yeah, uh, so that's a good point. The lemongrass sure is edible, but it's going to be tough, so you might need to be Pick aware of that. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. This one we, this one was a safe bet. <laughs> we love wings. <laughs> we love wings, and we love the lemongrass. The lemongrass is really successful. <clears throat> yeah, good. And the wings, look at that. Yeah. Mm. We're quite happy with that. What should we have next? Curry or dough? Curry. Let's do the curry. Cheers. 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 Mm, yeah. This one has really good color on it. It's super crispy. Is it? You can smell the curry. Smell the leaf. But it's not as um, prominent as the lemongrass, which is really more in your face. Question: Do you? Is it as dry, or does it does it seem more moist? Is it drier? I like it at this level of dryness. Yeah? 
interesting because I think having the large lemongrass stalk in the middle helps keep it moist, which is okay. why it's, which is why that one was more tender and why this one may be a bit drier. Um, yeah, so the last one, the Asian dill. Uh, dill generally is, pairs better with seafood and mm -hmm. fish in particular. We'll see how yeah. this goes. It was just something I wanted to try. I don't know if I smelled it as much as I thought I would. I oh no, I do. Oh, whoa. Whoa. It makes me think it's going to taste quite sweet. Tastes like fish. <laughs> I'm just here for the food. Yeah. <laughs> She's just here for the lulls and the chicken wings. Yeah, I wasn't sure what, what it was going to be like. Uh, I'm quite happy with it overall, actually. Mm -hmm. But I think I like it more than I thought. That's what I was going to say. Before Joyce heads out, she'll pick some herbs from the garden to take back with her. But before then, there's still grub to eat. What a morning and afternoon we've had. So, guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to check out Joyce's uh, show, Taste Buds. Hey. Um, and thank you guys for watching. Please take care of yourselves. Happy growing, everyone. We'll see you next time.